mum and dad met soon after the war, I believe, when dad came back from some training in, in America. Dad actually went with, or it was a blind date, I think, and I think he was supposed to be with the friend that she was with, but they, uh, his mate ended up with the friend, and then these two ended up together, and uh, they pretty much never looked back after that, as far as we could work out. So uh, the camera played a, the cine camera played quite a constant part in our youth, I think. It was always, every time Christmas or birthdays or holidays came round, the camera would be there or thereabouts. Uh, both cine and still cameras, it always did, we always had a, we had a flair, I think, for it and enjoyed, certainly enjoyed it, obviously, as you can see from some of the clips of the, usually ended up setting up some ridiculous sort of scenarios like throwing a stick out into the water and then he'd pretend to be a dog and go and chase the stick and bring it back in, in the, out of the sea and things like that it was just uh, but yeah it, it was just dad through and through he, he had no qualms about making a fool of himself on camera and uh, the only problem there was he usually he expected the rest of us to do the same <laughs> Nan would play along with it most of the time. She was a she was his model, I suppose, a lot of the time, and she he he was always getting making up, get into positions and doing things which she I don't know if she actually really wanted to, but she would kept play along with it and. Uh, she was always there and she always had a smile for the camera when it was needed. Yeah. <laughs> I think that was her fixed screen. Olive was one of her names at one point that we used to call her because as soon as the camera turned on her, the, the smile would appear. <laughs> Everybody went here, the cine camera went with him. So it was just one of those things, I suppose. It was just part of it. And it was, he always had the cine camera or a snapshot camera in his hand and he was always taking photos it just seems to be from from what we can remember yeah. <laughs> looking back on it and looking at the things that we've done and, and knowing that they were set up there are just great to watch and mm. great to have to be able to look back on and, and remember and, and that just it, that's a permanent record as well Wondering where those permanent record if those permanent records are going to be around in fifty years' time from what we're doing or not. I think with everything electronic now, then uh, will the electronic bits still be there in fifty years' time, and we'll be able to read them? Well, this sort of these sort of films that we're looking at here, they're just permanent, and uh, as long as you've got a a machine that can view them, then you can, you can keep looking at them. I say it's been fun. Just love looking through some of this old stuff in the last few weeks and months. It's been great memories there. <laughs>